good morning and welcome back to another video if you are new to my channel my name is natalie and today is day three of going to our house and painting it our first stop is lowe's because we need more paint brushes and just more supplies we ran out of supplies there's a lot that's still left to be painted a lot but derek's and lowe's right now getting everything we need. I cannot explain how sore I am, but every part of my body hurts from painting the house. Is that normal? Like, I'm a very athletic person. I haven't, you know, I'm an athlete. I work out every single day, pretty much. But for some reason, painting the house makes my body hurt really bad. Penny, the puppuccino's gone. Penny, the puppuccino's gone. <laughs> our last stop was Starbucks, and now we are on our way to the house. For those of you who may have been confused that we're painting a house or are not fully updated, we bought our first house. It's a little farmhouse, two bedroom, one bathroom. It's on 1.6 acres, and it is the cutest little thing definitely like a little dream home of mine. I dreamt of this home for years. We have been looking for a house for a long time. We've been living down here in North Carolina for four years? Something like that. Something like that. And we want something that's ours. We don't want to rent anymore. It's so expensive to rent and it's a waste of money. So we finally have our house. And that's what we have been painting for the last couple days. Um, Oh, and the other thing I want to tell you, it was built in 1945. It is so cute. And today I'm going to show you a little bit of what we've been painting. All right, I can't show you too much. So we're going to stare at the ground and that's what's going to look up at me when she talks. I'm so excited because we are finally getting to the walls that we are going to be painting a really pretty black. So the whole house is white and then we have some accent walls that are black. And we are finally done with all of the white, and we are about to paint our first wall that's going to be the accent wall. And I cannot wait! Derek, open it up, open it up! This is the color right here. That's the color! I love it, I love it! I really thought you were just dropping the foam in the paint bucket. That would have been terrible. Nats? So since I did the first slab of white on the walls, you want to do the honors with the black? I do, I do. Oh, I'm so excited. I love it. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. Oh, I already messed up. Nats. I'm sorry. How was I not? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wipe it off. Hurry. Am I doing this right? I don't know that I've been doing it right. I've just been covering up the holes. <laughs> I wanted to try it. It's very satisfying. Just trying to make the wall smooth. And then you sand it down, right? Yeah, just try and make it smooth before. Smooth with the wall or like? Yeah. Well, this is a big hole. Like, is that good? Mm-hmm. Perfect. So I did it? You're not going to touch it, are you? No. Nope. Promise on camera that you will not fix my work. No, I'm going to fix it. <sighs> we are home from a long, long day 
painting is tiring, it's exhausting, and it takes a lot of time. But we are almost fully finished with painting the whole house, but the kitchen. We are saving the kitchen because our friend from California, Salty, which a lot of you probably know him because we play video games and stream with him all the time. He's flying in. We're so excited. We're gonna hang out and have fun and do fun things in Charlotte, but we also are going to work on the house together. So he's gonna help us with the kitchen and a few other things, which I will bring you along for all of that too. But Derek just made breakfast for dinner, which is one of my favorites. And then I made these cute little reindeer Christmas cookies and I'm having a bowl of, a bowl of ice cream to end our day. Derek, come here. What? I look good <laughs> like this. How is, how is your day? Are you sore from painting? Like, are you excited? Does the home feel very homey and you're I'm ready to sore because we don't have any damn chairs in that house yet. So <laughs> I've been standing for the last 12 hours. We have been standing for the last three days. But the home is starting to feel so homey. It is day four of us coming to this house and making it our own. I'm going to give you a tour of the whole house. We have some rooms painted, some not, and I will explain to you everything we're gonna be doing throughout the house. Are you ready? Come on, let's go. Wait, first things first. This front door is going to be painted black, and so is the trim of the house, okay? The other stuff that we're gonna to do to the outside of the house, I will explain later, because there's a lot of stuff that's gonna be going on out here. But the door will be black. Come on in. These are the, the puppies. Okay, so this first room here, this first room, the first thing we're gonna do that is not done yet is we're getting new barn doors. And we painted this wall black. It needs to be touched up a little bit. As you can see, we're gonna be taping it and touching it up a little bit. The tape that Derek got was not good, so we had some bleed through. So we're gonna touch it up, but this wall is black and everything else we painted white. This is gonna be a seating area where there's a little fire and comfy chairs, where you can read books or work, do Zoom calls. This is what this room is gonna be. Now let's head to the first bedroom. This first bedroom's a mess right now, but when you come through this room, when it's completely finished, this ceiling is gonna be black. The walls are gonna be black. It's gonna be blacked out with neon, LED lights, and we are going to have, yeah, it's gonna be that same color. We're gonna have our lights in here, our streaming room, our eye racing setup. This is gonna be the streaming room. It's gonna be amazing. All right, so we're working on this room right now. That's what we're doing today. But as you come back out into the cute seating area that we're gonna have in here, and come to the next bedroom, this bedroom we painted all white and we left one of the walls untouched. That was the color of the whole house, that back wall. We are going to paint that, black, that wall black as well. And this is gonna be our bedroom. And we're gonna have a white bed in here with rustic looking furniture. Like um, right here, we're gonna have a little dresser for Derek to keep his clothes in and it's gonna be all rustic looking with all the white and black. So the theme of the house is really gonna be black and white with rustic pieces and wood accents. All right, come into the living room. This is the living room, and it was that tan color like you saw in the bedroom. We painted everything white, except for this wall, we painted black because we are going to put our TV here. And when the TV's off, we want it to look sleek and like disappear, and we're gonna have a little black fireplace here. The kitchen. We have so many things we wanna do with the kitchen. So first things first, the butcher block. We are going to take these white things off right here, sand these down, and restain them a lighter wood. We want them a really light wood, okay? So that's the butcher block. The walls are going to be white. The top cabinets, these ones and those ones, will be white to match the walls. The bottom cabinets will be black. Now come to the laundry room. We originally wanted to leave the laundry room how it is, but I changed my mind today and Derek's the first time he's hearing this. <laughs> okay, so I do want to paint it. And why Derek, why I want to paint it is I don't want to keep Yay, it. Yay, more paint. So come on in, come on in. 
Derek didn't want to paint it because of this. But I have full faith in Salty and Derek. Salty's our friend from California who's flying in. You probably know him if you're watching. Yeah, we our can streams. paint anything. It's if we want to paint. We are it. going to paint. We are going to paint this a different color. I'm not sure. Maybe white. I don't know. That is my dream kitchen. This is my dream house. But I don't think we are going to be able to live in our dream house. And all this hard work we're putting into it, it really makes me sad because I... It makes, it makes the puppies sad too.